What's up, guys? I'm back with my second uh, Let's Play over uh, Rust. This game's pretty freaking legit. And, man, um, I guess I died up there. Someone killed me. But I did spawn here nearby, so that's good. We can kind of pick up where we left off. But last time, that was pretty intense, guys, with that, uh, that Kevlar. And then... Uh, I got killed by a noob, so that was pretty bad. And then, man, my f bad excuse for a gamer friend, Kevin, got on the mic accidentally. So, that was uh, unexpected, let's just put it that way. Let's see what we got up here. I don't know why my... Uh, I don't know who killed me, is what I meant to say. There. They, might be, they might still be around here. Hey, is anyone in here? guess not. I did, I left right here though. That sucks. Anyway, I guess we're going to start over, get some wood. Uh, our goal is to put up a house this game, so we should be able to do that, uh, hopefully. And yeah, so, uh, oh, I'm ready for this. Man, this game is just really fun uh, to play by, I think I already said that last time, play by yourself. Uh, but, it gets pretty intense. I was playing on my own uh, server earlier, right before I started up this one to uh, start my next Let's Play, my second one. Uh, that's probably why I died. I'll try to do them more consistently. I think I waited about a day to do this one. I don't remember how long it's been, but uh, I think I think it was about a day in between since I did one again. But I was playing on my my own server earlier, and well, it's not my own. I don't I don't own it, but I was playing on another server earlier, and man, it got pretty intense on there too. Uh, had a big group of people chasing me, but it, I think they all had either really crappy connection or computers. One because none of them could hit me with their shotguns, but maybe they were just not shooting at me. But it, I don't know. It seemed like it. it seemed they were shooting pretty close to me. So either they're really good or really bad. Let's just put it that way. But it was pretty, it was pretty intense. But now we're on here, so hopefully we can get a house built before I get killed. Because a lot of the guys on the server are shoot on sight, I think. Um, from what I can tell, from what I could tell last ga last game. Uh, and then of course I killed a lot of people too, so. Or I tried, I attempted to kill quite a few people. But this game, I think I'm going to be a little more passive and try not to kill people because I want to really get this house put up and I don't want to die. So, hopefully one of my mini tactics of staying alive will help me. That's that's one of the th great things about... Man, I started off on, a, uh, on an official server, and some of you guys might not know what that means, but I'm going to explain it here. Basically, if you start off, if you start off on a... Fi let me start over. Let me start the. Let me. No. Okay. Let me start that sentence over. Okay. From the beginning, if you started on an official server, uh, then it's kind of like learning to drive on a sh. Uh. No. Nah. Mm. Uh, this is ju this is just not happening today. Okay. I'm going to completely start this over. If you see a wolf, run towards it. You won't expect it. Whoa, bro. Okay. Now, if you started playing on an official server, it's kind of like learning to drive on a shift stick. And that analogy is not any fun anymore because I messed it up 14 times. Whoa. Whoa. I did not mean to do that. But, yeah, it's kind of like learning to drive on a shift stick. You just never... It's, it's a really useful skill, and you just never forget it. And you're always good at playing the game, I would say, for the most part, if you play on it for a while. Because it gets pretty intense on there, and wow, I can't believe that just had bandages in it. But it does get pretty intense on those official servers, and it, there's a lot of cool stuff that goes down on those servers, and stuff that just you won't see on these uh, private servers, these uh, custom games. But it's pretty fun. So if you guys get this game, I'd recommend uh, playing it on a, an official server first, because it's just a great place to learn, and they're usually more packed. My, the, when I first started my official server, man, I, I got pretty good at it that way. And I was playing all by myself. That was before I started playing in any groups. And uh, I, I managed to get a metal house put up, but I had some really uh, 
bad. I went through some bad times on Rust, man. Like, got my house raided over and over and over and over, no matter how many times I moved it. I just couldn't get supplies together, and it all fell apart. But finally, I got a base together that actually worked. And, man, this reminds me of this place. This is where I used to be, like, how my base is at. But there used to be a huge tower here. Oh, man. I'm just having so many flashbacks right now. But there was a huge... Oh, Kevlar dude. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go up and talk to this guy. Since I don't have anything right now. Oh, is he, is he gonna kill that noob? Hey guys, are you shoot on sight? Are you the... No, you're not, are you? You're not the guys I was thinking of. Hey, there's some guys that have been shooting on sight. So if you see him, will, will you take him out for me? That'd be really helpful. Oh, that that's him, that's him, that's him, that's him up there. Can you guys take him out? That would be really helpful. This guy killed me and took all my stuff. Why did you take all my stuff, man? Can I can I please have my stuff back? My leather at least. Come on, man. You you have Kevlar, you don't need my leather. What do you want? I'm not taking your leather, dude. Thank you. Alright, well that just got me some free stuff, unless they shoot me. They're walking all around me. Feeling pretty crazy about this right now. Alright, well that was helpful. Hey, thanks for taking that guy out for me. I'll remember that later. Yeah, those are the guys from last time. I guess they don't remember me. I wouldn't. I mean, they only saw me for half a second. But, man, what was I saying? That got me some leather. That was that's nice. Start off again. Looks like my stuff from last time, but that that noob killed me with. But possibly a little bit better. But anyways, we're talking a huge tower right here. And this is when I first started. I didn't know anything about this game. It's dark. I'm like, what the heck am I doing? Walking around. I'm trying to. I, I'm looking through the options to figure out what the buttons are to chat. And I'm like, hey, can someone help me? And the guy in, in that tower is like, yeah, get over here right now. I'm like, where, where are you? He's like, in, in the tower. Come up to the door. I went up to Hello. the door. And, uh, yo, what's up, bro? What's up, dude? Hey, do you, uh, do you recognize me? I think I do. One of my friends told me about you. What are you talking about? He said you were friendly or something. I guess you aren't friendly, hi. Huh? No, I, I remember you killed me one time. Wait, dude, are oh. you the one we shot in the face with a pipe shotgun? No, 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 wait. No, you killed me with a uh, pickaxe, remember? I killed you with a what? You killed me with a pickaxe like this okay that was fun anyways <laughs> okay back to uh, what I was saying this guy uh, lets me into the uh, bottom oh why am I using the chat there the guy lets me into the bottom floor of his uh, house gives me supplies and stuff helps me get started and that's just my beginning memories of rust and that was that was really pretty cool uh, that was on an official too, and I did not realize at the time how many noob killers there were on here, how many spawn killers, and that was just so lucky for me to get started off that way. That guy was really cool. I still have him on my friends list. Um, I ended up building my house near there, and he was pretty cool. He, uh, he, uh, uh what, what did he do? One time, yeah. Okay, so, man, I feel like, uh, the doctor of Doctor Who just going from one subject to another, and then another. Anyway, so... He, uh, one time my house got raided, and he went in there, and he completely rebuilt it, completely rebuilt it, didn't have to do that, he did, put a new metal door on, I was freaking out, I got on, and I told him about it, and he's like, yeah, dude, that was me, and I was like, why did you take my house, and he said, oh, here's the code, I just wanted to save it, and I was like, wow, that's, that's really cool that someone would do that, so the officials aren't all bad, I, I think I made them sound really hardcore earlier, but... They're not all bad, they're pretty fun, and you get a chance to meet some cool people. Like, on, on here you can, on these types of games, but it's just not as common, I don't think. There's not as many people. But, yeah, I cannot believe I already got this stuff back. Um, we're gonna have to go all the way back to Split Rad, or I think I called it Small Rad in the last video. I probably called it something completely random, 
too because I completely lost my memory when I was thinking of the names of the places but it is called Split Rad or Small Rad and that's where I'm going to build my house out near there. That's also a pretty common place as you can probably tell me running around here. I'm trying to stick to the common places because there's a reason they're common. There's lots of resources here and the PvP aspect of this game is really what makes it fun and uh, if I'm just out by myself in the wilderness and whoa I'm getting shot at. That's not a bolt action though. I might not have been getting shot at. It might be someone up here but it wasn't a, it wasn't a bolt action. Hey, 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 I'm the guy that you just gave me the leather. Remember my leather back? Okay, okay. Alright. Right. Yeah, uh, my leather. Whatever. Uh, so, uh, sorry, I, I was just looking at that guy. He's, he's kind of eyeballing me like he wants to shoot me. But, uh, I completely lost my train of thought now. Well, let's start a new subject. How about mining? It's fun, right? Happens quick now. And it looks like it's starting to get dark. That's not going to be fun if I don't get my house up. Oh yeah, split red, small red. Okay, I think I called it split red or small red. It doesn't really matter. You can call it whatever you want. But if you play on the officials, you'll, you'll learn the real names for things. If you, if you go on a, another server like this or... A, uh, just a random public server that's not an official server people are gonna call it something completely random most likely not even the real name and you're gonna learn these random names so if you're gonna do that if you're not gonna play on an official to start please go to rustmap.net because sometimes I'll be asking people in world chat where the heck they are and they'll tell me some random place and I'm like that that's not even a real place so please don't be that noob that doesn't know what places are called. I'm, I, I know I, I'm kind of being a hypocrite here because I didn't know what Big Rad Town was when I saw it. Well, it was industrial, wasn't it? And I called it Big Rad Town. But anyways, just know the names of some of the valleys, like Resource Valley, Hacker Valley, some of the common places so that you can tell people where you are or you can know where other people are if you see it in World Chat. Don't be that noob that doesn't know. Seriously, guys. This is probably pretty dangerous. Uh, ooh, kind of, kind of debating whether I should go over here or not. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. It's going to split rad. This is not, is it? No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Yes, it is. This is split rad. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. It's big rad. We can't. No, we, no, it's not. No, yeah, it's split, Rad. I'm just on the other side of it. See, I'm that noob. I guess they oh, there they are. Hey. Hey. Hi, man. Oh, God, that dude. Hey, what's up? He's not friendly. He is not friendly. He killed. What? He killed Puffy. What are you talking about? I've yeah, never even me. seen you before. I've never been around oh, yeah. here ever. Yeah, get out of here. He's gonna kill you. <laughs> I don't, I don't even know yeah, you. Who are you? Yeah, yeah. I don't even know you. Oh, you're going to chase me? Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Oh, it's game time now. And you guys suck. You're not going to be able to hit me. You can chase me all across the map. That's what I thought. Yeah, I think I've already made quite a few enemies in this game. I said I was gonna. I think I said I was gonna be passive trying to be passive this game but it just it just didn't work I kinda had that in my mind I'm like I'm not gonna fight people I'm not gonna be that guy but I am that guy I'm just that guy at heart I'm not really at that stage in the game yet where I can be doing that crap I don't know I don't have fun in killing noobs but people like that man that's that's thrill in this game man I take those people out but I'm just not at that stage where I can do that yet so yeah, I'm gonna have to try to tone it down a little bit. Hopefully that won't happen again. Let's find a pig though and chop some pig's hind legs off and eat them for lunch. Doesn't that just sound delicious? Yum. Because when you think about it, what is that? That's just a bunch of bacon and ham. That's delicious. And I don't want to have any part of that. So let's go around. So. 
Man, let's let's think about what what do we know about this server so far? Okay, we got the two guys in the full Kevlar. Uh, that little group over there, which I guess they stay around there before. I think those are the guys that killed me last time. Uh, oh, another wolf. What else? Have I met anyone else on here? No, I don't think I don't think I have yet. I'm trying to I'm trying to make like tabs in my head and try to remember these people because that's gonna come into play later. I'm definitely going to raid that house when I get some C4. Which man, I'm starting off so slowly. I usually don't start off this slowly, but uh, I've just kind of been messing around too much. So I'm gonna try to get some wood down here in Resource Valley. Derp. This can be actually there. Like I said before, names. This there are actually multiple valleys that can be called Resource Valley. This one is pretty commonly called Resource Valley, but if it's not, then it's usually the one where all of those animals were. That's actually got another name, but um, this one's most often called Resource Valley, but y you know, some of them can be, do have multiple names, but you just hear people using random names for stuff, and it really annoys the heck out of me. That's why I can't stand world chat sometimes. It just, oh man. On uh, on those official servers, the world chat would always be the same people, and they would just fill it up. And I eventually just had to kind of stop uh, using it, just kind of turn it off like I have my game right now. There's nothing back there. So, I don't know. It's just, it's a really great game. If, if you never had the chance to play it when it was in really early, early, early access, then you really missed out. But... It's still a great game. You can still get a lot out of it if you buy it now. I mean, obviously, it's been updated, so it's not worse. It's just, it's one of those things where when you play it when it's just brand new, it's, there's so much fun stuff about it that they've taken out. There used to be zombies in this game. I don't know if I already mentioned that, but... Yeah, there used to be zombies, and then they completely took them out. You don't even see them. You see red bears and wolves now. So, yeah, it's a lot different now. And now we're back at... Uh, industrial so this is where I was gonna build wasn't it I'm not sure if I have enough yet I don't think I do I might have enough for one I think I have 250 yeah that's not gonna be enough um, but I need to build a campfire so let's go ahead and put the base down where I want it the foundation what is this oh man is this pass gonna get raided yeah, it is. It is. It wants to get raided. All right. So, uh, do we have any chicken left? No, we have no chicken left. Man, I need to make that my priority. Uh, I have no chicken at all. I guess I don't even know if I ever had any. I have such a bad memory. I was just playing on my other server, so let's go ahead and take out this pig if we can without having... Oh, crap. See, that was what I was afraid of. I'm running out of uh, food. You can't see it's down on the bottom right hand corner if you don't know where it's at. That's my food. I could probably take out this wolf if I stop right now. There we go. That's going to get me a lot of food. And most importantly, I think I just used a rad pill. Yeah, I did. I didn't mean to do that. Most importantly, though, it's going to get me a uh, cloth, which I'm going to need to make a sleeping bag. And let me turn down my speakers a little bit. But we should get some food, too. Yeah, that's good. I think I already got enough for a sleeping bag right there. Hopefully I did. I need a sleeping bag. That's where you spawn. You haven't seen me spawning yet. That's because I don't have a sleeping bag. And yes, I did get enough. It takes 15 to make a sleeping bag. 15 cloth. But... Yeah, I'm just kind of rambling on here. Let's go up here and raid this house that I found. Oh, you know, I don't even know where it was. That's pretty sad. I already lost it. Okay. I think it was over here. Oh, gosh. I'm almost out of food. I'm going to get right up here next to it and put this down. No. Yeah, yeah. Here it is. This is it. Or is this a new one? This is a different one. My gosh. There's a lot of them back here. Hello. Hey, bro. I'm gonna I'm gonna make some food here. So. What? You new to the game? Yes. Yeah. Well, I'm making some food. So you want to check it out? You can just sit back and watch. But 
Uh, if you access my fire and or attack me, I will completely annihilate you. As you can see, I'm in uh, some nice armor and you're naked and I've got a pickaxe and you don't so this will go straight through your skull into your tiny little brain and you will die so uh, now that we've got that cleared up we're cool right just don't attack me don't access my campfire and we'll be good I'm about to starve need some food oh yeah it it uh, cooks faster if you split it. Yeah, I'm just kind of telling you guys random things as I go, but that that'll cook really quickly. Let's see what's in here. Um, yeah, this is the one I was looking at earlier. And bust down this door. Hey, is this yours? Yes. Oh, that's cool. Living by my I wouldn't have put this campfire down if I'd have known this was your house here. Well, you it's have. Right, man. I don't really care. You have fun with it. Um, I'm gonna get out of here. This guy doesn't have anything at all. Uh, and we don't have enough wood to really make a house yet. We're just gonna have to make a small one somewhere nearby here, and then switch it out later. See, I don't really want to kill this guy. I don't I don't get any pleasure out of it. Oh, airdrop, airdrop, airdrop. Oh man. Oh man. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I don't know if I said anything about airdrops last time. Hey, let's go get that AD, man. You, did you see where it went? Oh, it went up on that hill. Oh crap, man. You wanna go up there? Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Hang on. Alright, alright, alright. I'm gonna I'm gonna put down a small hut over here. So I can uh Oh crap, I didn't eat that food. Alright man, I'm gonna put down a small hut and some stuff in it so I can uh, keep my safe my safe stuff, my stuff safe, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, and then we'll head up there. You, you nearby? Oh, he's, he's back there. Alright, he's already gone. Alright, let's put it right here. Let's put it right here. Uh, let's go ahead and craft real quickly. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Um, I don't know what that's supposed to mean. I've never seen him do anything on here like that. Wood shelter. Craft, craft, craft. Where's a wooden doorway? Oh man. We're about to start hearing shooting like crazy. Probably. Unless someone just took it really quickly. Where's the wood door? There it is. Alright. So, we did get a small place crafted. Uh, I'm sorry if that my mic was a little bit out of center there. My uh, eye. I was a little bit out of center of the mic. Uh, but, there we go. Let's sit right there. And am I... What am I... Oh, well, I'm crafting. Okay. I was wondering why I was going so slow. Uh, get that door up, and then we're going to head right up there. Hopefully get something out of the AD. I really need a storage box before I go, too. And a sleeping bag. Yeah, I'm not really ready to go yet. But I usually just scavenge the remains, like I said earlier. Hopefully some people will have already been up there and killed each other. And it's not going to let me put the door on, is it? Uh, right, right there. Okay. That's a cool thing about group bases. If you hold E over the door, I'm not going to do it right now, but you will notice uh, I can add... I'll just do it right now. Okay. I said I wasn't going to, but you can add a lock. So, uh you and your friends can share a base that's one really cool thing they added uh, pretty recently that's just made this game really cool you used to um, I, I actually had to do this at one point you used to have to um, build a house with multiple doors and then you can only use the door that you put in the house so it was pretty interesting can't place that there how about how about there oh I can place it right there in front of the doorway okay Let's just go ahead and throw this crap in here. I'm already way behind. If anyone's out there, they've already gotten the stuff. This kid seems pretty cool. I think I think we should team with him, maybe. I don't know. 
not really team with him, but just kind of help him out a little bit, because he's he's obviously a noob. Like, I, I would feel bad killing a noob like that. I don't know, man. I'm just, it's just not in my nature to kill noobs. Uh, what do we not need? What do we not need? Uh, small stash. Let's put it down on top. Let's go ahead and search it. Bam. Bam. Craft a sleeping bag. This has really got me going here nah, quicker. Get that sleeping bag crafted, and we should be good to go. Yeah, I think the 80s have definitely been taken. Hopefully there will still be some people fighting, but I haven't heard any gunshots. So hope Maybe the 80s will still be there. I don't even know. Maybe no one saw them, but I really doubt that. I don't even know if I could find them if they were up there. And then, What are we running? 25 minutes? It's almost time to call it, but... Let's go see if we can get that airdrop or some remains of something really quickly. I have a feeling this house is going to get raided, but I don't know. Alright, let's get up there. I feel like a mountain goat. Oh crap. Not anymore. Would have broken my legs off that drop. Okay. Uh... I don't really want to pull out a torch right now, someone would see me, but I'm not hearing any shooting, which is really surprising. If someone got it, they went up there and got it and left, and there was no fighting or anything, which is really uncommon at airdrops. They're usually really big items, uh, lots of people fight over them, and I have gotten gone to airdrops where people are just fighting so much they don't even notice who had the airdrop last. Uh, they'll be spread throughout bodies, and you just by looting bodies instead of trying to get to the crate, you'll get a lot of stuff, so that's really useful. Alright, I'm almost up on the top of this mountain. Oh, it's getting night. That's when it gets intense, or it used to. Not not so much anymore. It used to get intense at night, though. And I'm not seeing anything. The airdrops might be lost forever to this landscape, this rocky landscape up here. Yeah, man, there's no way I'm going to find those airdrops. Um, there's Big Rad down there. Okay. Yep, yeah, they're gone. Someone either took them or uh, they're just lost. I'm not going to find them. There's no way. Let's see if there's anyone up here, though. Oh, this house has been raided. Let's check it. Rocks. Did I already check this one? Yeah, I did. I'm gonna remember there's some furnaces up here and a workbench if I need them. Huh. That's really odd. That message, though, maybe they were fake airdrops? I don't even know. Uh, but that message that the admin sent us. This is a little bit confusing. I would world chat right now, but I'm kind of afraid of what will be on there. Um, yeah, guys, I think this is all we're going to get done in one game. Been pretty interesting, though. Uh, finally got that little shack put up. Uh, it's pretty crappy, but we have some extra wood. And I'll mine some more next time. I'm I'm not sure. You guys tell me if you think I should um, if you think I should mine in between games, or if you think I should just do what I've been doing, mining during the games, because it takes a lot of time. It's not a lot of time for other stuff when I'm doing that. So you guys tell me what you think. And oh, there's some rad boots. You know these these are pretty good. They're pretty. I don't want to say they're like really good for armor, but they're okay for armor. You know, I could slap a door on this. I could literally slap a door on that. You know, I'm gonna do that. I don't know. It's it's been raided, but mine's not even in that good of a spot. So that's that's really ooh. Mine's just out in the open. It's gonna get raided quickly. We need to get it out of the way. I don't even know if I can find it again. I might suicide. Well, guys, that's pretty much it. I'm probably going to call this video uh, right right here, and I'll just find my house on my own. Uh, 
that's pretty much it, guys. Um, uh, and I died. You silly sod. Let's respawn at a camp. What did I lose? Did I lose anything? It's just some chicken. Well, till next time, guys.